Thanks, Lester. Now to your destination. Travel Zoo, Travel Zoo's Gabe Saglier is here to tell us which vacation spots are offering the best bang for your buck. Hey, Gabe, good morning. Morning, Jenna. Well, let's start with the more popular ones, the beach spot getaways. Yeah. What are the best travel deals if you want to go hit the beach? Well, I don't have to tell you, St. Thomas, you're yeah. getting there in a couple of weeks. And now everybody knows. Thanks, Gabe. Appreciate <laughs> <Sorry>. that. <laughs> Look accordingly, my friends. Uh, all right, so St. Thomas, here's a U.S. territory, so no passport required. Uh, you can do, for example, a little five-day, four-night getaway to a place like the Marriott Fisherman's Reef Resort, a gorgeous four-star property, clifftop, and beachside. Not there staying there, by beach. the way. No, you're not so staying there. Uh, but you can do for three forty-nine with air out of Miami. Five days at this resort includes a free upgrade. The price out of New York is three sixty-nine, four nineteen out of L.A. So even out of the West Coast, Caribbean prices are very, very low. On the other side of the spectrum, in Hawaii, Hawaii hotel prices have gone uh, really way down over the last uh, several months. The Hilton Hawaiian Village, a gorgeous four-star property, very popular with families, one seventy-nine for a an ocean view room, which usually goes for more than 300 and you book it for six nights. Your seventh night is free, and you get free luau show for two. Wow. That's what travel through June. And if you want to head down to Costa Rica, beautiful Costa Rica, you can do a six-night, week-long package to Costa Rica for as little as $4.99. It includes airfare, uh, two nights in uh, the capital of San Jose, Look two nights in Arenal, deals. which is a home to an active volcano, two nights in Monteverde, a uh, cloud forest there, and then breakfast every day, and your own 4x4 four four mini SUV with unlimited mileage to Traverse the uh, landscape of Costa Rica, four ninety nine out of Miami, Fantastic. and just a little bit more out of Chicago, New York. What about if we wanted to go a little further, a little more international? Are there deals there as yeah. well. Yeah, international airfare way down. Australia, for example, big deals there. United has a sale to fly you out of New York City for three ninety nine each way down to Sydney or Melbourne. That price out of the West Coast is just two ninety nine each way, and of course that results in some great packages. Ireland, for example, a company called Scepter Tours will take you to Ireland for five, uh, make that six nights round trip air out of New York, five ninety nine. You get to stay one night in a four-star hotel in Shannon, four nights at a B&B &B of your choice. You get your own car to drive around, and then what your fifth deal. night is at this five-star Adair Castle, uh, which, again, for $5.99 out of uh, New York, $6.99 out of the uh, West Coast. These deals are fantastic, but some people don't obviously want to go too far, and they only have a couple days off now. Is Are there good places and good deals within yeah. uh, within the continental U.S. that you we know, can uh, go to? Yeah, four or five-star hotels in big cities, which have seen not only a drop-off in leisure, but also business travel, big bargains. For example, here in New York City, the Millennium in Broadway, four-star hotel in the heart of Times Square, 149 a night. Uh, if you want to make it out to Chicago, the Hyatt Regency, Four Diamond Hotel, $99 a night. That includes breakfast for two. And even popular seaside uh, enclaves like San Diego, California, the uh, Solomar, Kimpton Property, 109 a night for rooms that usually approach 300. And that includes a free bottle of wine in your room, free complimentary evening wine hour. And that's in the heart of the gas lamp quarter, beautiful hotel. Worth definitely worth the 109. Are these deals just around now while the economy is where it is, or do you foresee these these kind of sticking around for a little bit? Well, definitely economy driven, and the fact is that a lot of us are cut back on our leisure travel. As long as that remains a fact, I think these uh, deals, airfare, hotel, particularly, and vacation packages will remain very aggressive all the way through the summer. Good. Maybe you'll come on next year and tell people we're on vacation, <laughs> and then too we'll have a blast with that. Gabe Seglier, thank you so much. Thanks. Great deals out there. We appreciate you sharing. And now let's head back to Lester. Oh,